A new video has emerged, apparently showing Conservatives partying during the height of Covid. In the footage obtained by the Mirror newspaper, Tory staff can be seen dancing and drinking together while lockdown rules were in effect. Two of those in the video were among people awarded peerages in Boris Johnson's honours list. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. But he's like, oh, really to be honest, it's not her boyfriend. No. No, it's not. Can we spread that? Yeah, yeah. Let's make sure that I get some It's for party um, use. It's not an ad. Instagram live. As long as we don't scream that we're like... <laughs> well, Sky's Ali Fortescue uh, joins me now. Ali, uh, this video is quite something, isn't it? And it's going to reignite criticism uh, of Boris Johnson just days after that damning Privileges Committee report was published. Yeah, that's right. I mean, the timing is obviously incredibly uncomfortable. This was footage that the Mail have uncovered. It was filmed in December 2020, if you can remember. That was back when the tier system happened, when lots of families weren't able to see each other at Christmas, when, for a lot of the country, people could not mix indoors. So it was pretty much, you know, the height of lockdown. And you can see that video there. I counted about eight people that can be seen, um, obviously, dancing, glasses, of wines and wine in people's hands, some people wearing uh, party hats. The mirror say that um, 20 plus people were at this uh, event. I think what's particularly uncomfortable is you can hear a bit of a conversation there. Someone saying, "Are you filming this?" Uh, as long as we don't seem like we're bending the rules, another person off camera uh, says. Two of the people at um, this event or involved in this event um, did receive. Honours. One was Sean Bailey. Of course, this was his campaign team. He's not actually in that footage, but he did previously apologise um, for the event. He, of course, wanted to be mayor of London, was a Conservative uh, candidate. He says he shouldn't have made a speech to a group of people um, that evening. Um, people have been working on his campaign. And Ben Mallett, um, who can be seen in the footage, he... Uh, on the uh, with the braces on the left of that picture, um, he received an OBE in Boris Johnson's honours list. Um, so obviously it is uncomfortable. CCHQ Conservative Party headquarters, which is where um, this footage was filmed, have released a statement. They say um, C senior CCHQ staff became aware of an unauthorised social gathering in the basement of Matthew Parker Street organised by the Bailey campaign on the evening of the 14th of December 2020. Formal disciplinary action was taken against four CCHQ staff who were seconded, um, seconded rather, to the Bailey campaign. As you say, Jonathan, this is all particularly uncomfortable uh, because this comes right after the Privileges Committee report last week, that damning verdict on Boris Johnson's behaviour during Partygate. And, of course, we're just a few days in to the COVID inquiry that continues next week. On Friday, 39-year-old Michael Vlodic, who's a 35-year-old Monica Vlodarczyk, and 11-year-old Maya Vlodajek, as well as three-year-old David Vlodajek. Now, murder detectives are heading the investigation, but no one else is currently being sought in connection with the incident. Well, let's cross live now to our correspondent, Ivor Bennett, who's in the newsroom for us now. Ivor, what more can you tell us? Yeah, this is a statement that's come through in the last few moments from the Metropolitan Police. They still don't know the exact circumstances to, that led to the, the deaths of these four people, um, all of whom they believe to be related. Obviously, they all share the same surname, if uh, their belief is correct. Uh, they say formal identification is yet to take place, but uh, these four people whose bodies were discovered yesterday afternoon at this flat in Hounslow in West London um, are uh, Michael Vlodacic, uh, Monica Vlodacic, they're aged 39 and 35, respectively, and two children, Maya, aged 11, David, aged 3, and, and, and this is a photo of uh, the four. As I say, police uh, believe all four are to be are related. Um, 
their investigation continues at the property. Uh, as I say, this is a flat, it's an upstairs flat uh, in Hounslow in West London. Forensic investigators, specialist officers have been coming and going there, gathering evidence, taking it away, um, as they try to piece together what led to these four people's death yesterday. Uh, the investigation is being led by murder det detectives, but the, um, the person leading that inquiry, uh, the chief superintendent, they've spoken to the media this afternoon and said that at this stage in their inquiry, they're not seeking anyone.